All right, me boys, welcome back again to Shark Dating Simulator XL. I'm recording this right after the last one because I actually got such a kick out of this. If you guys like this video, you know what? You know the drill. We'll mention at the end too. Remember to drop a like, specifically a subscribe if you got one, just laying around, but whatever. So let's get back into it. <laughs> nice to finally be on dry land again. Pretty sick of the ocean at this point. Smell that sea air, senpai. Sure feels good to draw in more than ample lungs. You could say that again. Holding all those conversations with the scuba gear in my mouth has been a little challenging. What do we do next? I'll tell you what we do, senpai. I haven't gotten laid since I was turned into a shark, but by George, I'm still going to make it work for it. I hope you collected plenty of balls. Let's take a look. Show me those balls of yours. <laughs> well, I can't refuse that request, now can I? Hmm. Oh. You, you've you not really been blessed by Mother Nature exactly, have you, senpai? I mean, you've got something going on there. There's not much of it. Look, I did my best. Oh, well. <laughs> I guess beggars can't be choosers. And there's some more factors regarding your balls as well. Like, really tight jeans? Indeed. But I'm more thinking about actions than consequences. For example, do you remember when we met on our first date? What, you mean that we had a date like half an hour ago? I believe I recall it, yes. Well, you were very charming when we said hello. Even though I was in shark form, you saw my inner beauty. That was very nice of you. And being nice makes your balls get bigger. Finally, we come to the time when I transformed. Then it was a very important moment for me, senpai. It was my big reveal. And let me see. Let me see if I can recall exactly what it was you said. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, yes. Now you must send me right. I, I got off pissed here. But I believe the words you said were hella thick. No, no, what I actually said, uh, just smell a stick. Nice try, dweeb, but no dice. And way less balls. Way less. I had it coming. I knew there was going to be a negative consequence, but I had to. Oh, no. Now here's what we play. Your balls are finally going to drop. When you click the mouse, that's it. And you must ping as many of the balls you of my heart as you can. If you score 180 points, you get to have me. What if I don't? Then it's the booby prize for you. It won't be easy with your little tiny sack of balls. <laughs> Still, you do have something going on, so maybe a technique can save you. Who knows? Let's do it. Oh boy, here we go. Got a caffeine up. Oh shit. Um, here. I need what, 180 points? They said. Oh, come on. Oh, uh, please. We'll, we'll just see how this goes, man. We, we can only try. Oh, this is getting away. She has a tattoo. This is a step pad. Oh, no. Alabama 100, boys. <laughs> this is... This is totally whack for my channel, but I love it so much. I hope you guys do like it as well. I use as many of them as I did earn before. We have... Two. Oh, I cannot show that for sure. She's straight titties out, but you know what? We're rocking. It's the same thing with uh, Honey Pop, which I actually want to play if you guys are interested for sure. Okay, we're going to have to get really lucky with this last one. Oh, no. I kind of fucked that up. Oh, maybe not. Come on. Just. Oh, no. We got so close. Oh, fiddle. I fail. Well, that doesn't mean. Well, doesn't that beat the shit out of everything? Howdy ho, loser. Guess you ain't seeing any more of this, then. But don't worry yourself, you still get booby prize. And what's that, then? I'll show you. Ah. Oh, shit, I don't like where this is going. Well, that was quite an amazing adventure. Oh, I guess I didn't let the play- You know what, it's probably good we didn't let the cutscene play. My poor little guy. It looks like somebody has been over it with a disc sander. <laughs> Wowie. I don't want to fucking know. But at least everything has been brought to satisfactory conclusion. Where the fuck is my fucking fish? Oh, yeah. Ooh. Um, er, I don't believe this. I'm standing here astounded. Where have you been all day? Why could you manage to do the simplest thing? Why did I ever trust you? You are a complete bonehead. You know that? I am aghast at what a total waste of space you are. Is that so, Marina? Well, there's something you should know. 
I just got fucked by a great white shark. You're a total bitch, so snack on that. I'm really, really sorry. You're a total bitch, so snack on that. Well, nice observation, genius. Wow, you know, I never realized that. Of course I'm a massive bitch. <laughs> Wouldn't you be? Well, actually, you are. But at least I have a reason for it. Let's, uh, let's set aside you, which obviously is a good enough reason for Gandhi and just concentrate on everything else. My career has gone down the pipe just because you couldn't do one simple thing. God, I just, I just hate you so much. Why, well, I, I can actually taste it. It's like a sour, underripe cherries in my mouth. I just love to see you remorsely pounded into a hamburger by some huge ape of a man with fists like sledgehammers. God, I'm getting moist just thinking about it. Oh, I get it. Well, how about we have really, really angry sex? That might help. Sex? With you? Exactly. How much cheap gin did your mother consume while you were in the womb? It has to be a lot, right? Mmm. It was the Thunderbird, actually. Brilliant. Everything just fell perfectly into place. Well, there's nothing else for it. Like it or not, I'm stuck with you. I can't have you running your whore mouth off to everyone about my discovery. I'll just have to bite daddy's ear for some more funding. Daddy? Yeah, he's high. He's rich as King Chris. Ah, whatever. He invented the hat. Made a mint out of it, the old bastard. He'll fund another trip if I cry hard enough. He invented the hat? What hat? Not what hat, you dink. The hat. He invented the entire concept. How old is he? 52, but what the hell does that have to do with anything? Why are we even discussing this? I'm gonna get on the phone with him as soon as he wires the catch through, we're coming back. And next time, you won't fuck up. You hear me? Oh, cool, so we're getting more funding. I hear you, Marina. I can hear the phantom call of the sea. My junk sure hurts. <laughs> Did not need to know that, my guy. Shark Dating Simulator XL, presented by... What? Is that the entire game? So if I continue, do I not get to continue? Well, that was sure an amazing adventure, my poor little guy. What? So I just have to try this again? Uh, we're gonna try and get through this. Uh, uh, we'll do that one. Oh, lottie fucking das. You and me got pounded by a massive undersea predator. So what? Boo-hoo, you little- What about me? I'll never win the fish Nobel Prize now. I got these fake boobs put in for nothing. Look, it all just turned out to be a tad more complex than we bargained for. There still happens to be a talking fish to be had. I'll get one now. Oh no, don't do me any favors, dill hole. It's over. I give up. Everything's borked. My career, my dreams, the con continuity of time, everything. Oh, don't lose hope, Marina. We could come again tomorrow. No, we can't. Don't you ever listen? My budget is all gone. Spent three days of worthless boat hire. Which, would a hug make you feel better? If you ever attempt to touch me, I swear to the seven flaming demons of hell. Bugger it. I suppose there's nothing to be do than ask. Okay, so we got this. Uh, I guess I do, Marina. I guess I do. Is this going to lead in the end again? Okay, I'm going to try the other one and we'll see if it turns out different. Stop. Just stop. Oh, for God's sake, stop crying. I can't help but I've let you down. I've let fish science down. But worst of all, I let you down, Marina. You said that already, you twonk. God, I just, I just don't understand what kind of function of any normal society. I've never met anyone so mind-twistingly dim. How often do you find yourself put your underwear on backwards? Oh, come on. That hardly happens much. Give me a favor, okay? If you're ever involved in some terrible hideous accident, make sure you get it recorded. I want to watch it every birthday I ever have. It would be like your little gift to me. I might even masturbate to it because the idea of you being horribly crushed quite honestly turns me on. Are you coming on to me? Listen, you, in you insufferable shit. You've ruined my life and now you're going to fix it. I can't hire anyone else because I don't want this secret getting out like it or not. I'm stuck with your dumb ass. Okay, and she's going to get the money. I don't want to read that anymore because honestly that was kind of... Yeah, I may not give me my word as a gentleman. I will not fail you again. Thank you for trusting me to make things right. Let's get one thing's clear. I've had herpes scabs. I was sadder to lose than I would be to lose you. You're the you are only getting another chance because I'm stuck with you. Get out of my sight. 
you know what? I think she's warming up to me. Not surprisingly, a man, a beautiful woman here, under the sky, upon a sundrenched sea. Romance is sure to blossom. I sure hope she's kidding about the harpies. Until next time, Ocean. Next time. I'm gonna look up and see if there's more of this. This might be like some kind of beta because it says Mark Three on the actual thing. If there's more later, we're going to come back to it. But if not, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, remember to rate, comment, subscribe. Well, that gets up. So, guys, stay awesome. Star Travesty, out.